All right, guys. So this week on the Body Project Podcast, we are talking about nutrition and resetting during this uncertain time, right? Everybody's talking about the new normal because of COVID. And I wanted to show you one of the recipes that's inside the Green Shake Challenge that you can do if you are looking to reset your nutrition and kind of reset your health and fitness goals during this time. So we are going to talk about that extensively tomorrow on the podcast, but I wanted to share with you on this beautiful Sunday a recipe for you to try. It's super simple and oftentimes you have most of these things in your house. So usually I start with a base. Today I'm using uh, an almond milk and I have a blend deck, but if you have a uh, Vitamix or even like a Ninja or a Magic Bullet, these are always great to have or any old school blender usually does pretty well. So I usually add in about a cup of almond milk. You can use regular cow's milk or cashew milk, rice milk, whatever you have available. I like to put a cup of ice in because it makes it super icy and frothy. And for me during the summer months, it always feels like it's kind of like a ice cream milkshake. Then today I'm using for the green part of our shake, a uh, avocado. Avocados are really high in omega fatty acids, really good for your health. Um, and really amps up the creaminess in a shake. So half of that going in. Then today I'm using a protein by Age Cruncher. So this is a lactose-free um, protein that is uh, made from marine collagen as well as um, it's loaded with probiotics, which I love having as part of my food so that you always have really healthy gut bacteria. So I use a scoop and a half, half of that. Um, I will post some details below if you're interested in trying this out. And then today I'm going to use some frozen berries, some organic frozen berries that I stuck in my freezer um, that were kind of like the last out of each container. So that's about a cup of that in there. And then I like to add in stuff like this. So this is chia seeds, organic chia seeds that are actually wrapped up with probiotics. Um, to add in. I generally stick in about a tablespoon of chia seeds. Oftentimes you'll see me putting in um, turmeric powder, hemp seeds, you can use flax seeds, you could use MCT oil, coconut oil if you're looking to make this a really wholesome comprehensive shake. And then it's as simple as that, right? And then you blend it up. So the nutrient density in a shake like this is incredible. Really super simple. And especially if you're on the go, if you're super busy running around managing your kids or just at the cottage during the summer, this is an amazing way to get some nutrients in that it makes it taste and feel like it is decadent. And if you are looking to reset this month, join us, right? We are doing the Green Shake Challenge, the seven day challenge with amazing recipes for you to try. Things like this that are super simple with things that you have in your house. And if you don't use something like a whey protein, a lactose free whey protein, you can use a vegan protein. You can use any other ones. I would just recommend something that is like this, a third party tested um, shake, uh, sorry, protein that is really good in bioavailability. You never want something that is full of fillers and crap in it uh, because you won't be able to absorb it and it won't be optimal for you. So I will show you the end result of this after I blend it. So sometimes I find one of the challenges I run into is adding a lot of ice because I like it super icy and creamy. Um, so sometimes you might find that you need to add in a little bit more of your almond milk or water or whatever it is. But I just want you to kind of see that consistency. It is literally like a milkshake. It is super, super delicious. So let me just get all of this in so I can show you the final product. 
my kids are behind the scene watching today, and my daughter is going to hand me a couple little things to garnish with. I don't know if you guys can see this, but this is amazing. Nice and thick, loaded with uh, antioxidants, omega fatty acids, some really good protein. So this actually makes for a really nice balanced meal if you're replacing a breakfast or lunch. No, stick it on here. Give me three. Um, and in terms of nutrient density, this is 30 grams of protein for this one, right? Which is super amazing. Can you see all my kids' little hands? Good, throw it in. No, just leave it, leave it. Good. So you can see it is this complete, beautiful, thick, delicious, delicious, super thick shit. Anyways, I will post the details wherever you're watching this in terms of how you can get all the recipes in our Green Shake Challenge and how you can try it out yourself. Have a beautiful it's day. It's purple, not green. It's purple, not green, Mommy. Yeah. Are you going to try it?